Hello, faithful viewers, and welcome to Mr. Who Review. They are reviewing Avatar The Legend of Korra, Book 4, Episode 9, Beyond the Wild. A lot of stuff happens in this episode. First of all, a turtle group in Pogo City gets captured by spear vines when going through the garden that the spear vines created. And Cora is Cora and Dinora and Opal are trying to find them. Or the Opal and Cora because Dinora shows up and she sent something. And Cora finds out that Kovir is taking spear vines from the swamp and and do I tell like the president and, and the council and all, all that. But they're talking I have the deal with Kovir and he just interrupts me and and I, and then Verick um Bonin come in and tell him about um Kovir's super weapon. And there's some tension between Bonin and Opal that it, it, it's not bad, but it's just the same meh. It really seemed that good. Like, it seemed okay. It seemed like some sort of that Bonin would do. Like, he got her to come to, like, a party, get her to a picnic with, him, with her because he could send a uh, hobby to. Fire fair to her and I don't know honestly he broke he broke his two legs. Oh my god. And C and Sue are trying to break out break out her her family or they're trying to plan a break out from Xiao Fu. All the while Zonora gets captured by the spirit ones as well, trying to find the other group, the Tro group. You know, and Cora uh, is trying to find him in the spirit world, but instead, see, it's a here taunting her and just taunt, haunting her in a way. So she asks to see him, talk to him, or just see him in, his pri in, in the prison he's in. At first, Tenzin is just uh, worried because he's, just, he's scared of losing Cora because he's just worried about Zenora. Because and it shows that the the bond the, or the relationship between two, these two have really changed. Back in the first series, they're the student teacher, but all through the four seasons, their bond has become one of a father and a daughter. Get to right here, man. Get to right here. Anyway, Cora sees to here in the prison a man. It's just creepy. Hamble left her signs and lamps. Creepy. Up lamps and lamps. Up lamps. He just seems scary. Even when he just, just pops out at her. He takes up by her head off or something. And you see that he is kind of on core so I see things that Covera should be stopped as well and helps her to get to this spirit world, which shows that even enemies can help each other out. Even if they try to kill each other in the last season, or in Zahir's case, try to cause chaos. Kind of, he's just, he's just like unpredictable sometimes, isn't he? Hmm. And Cora finds the Zenora and the Toro group and releases them and it's kind of weird where they were because it looks like they're in pods kind of reminds remind me what uh, Poison Ivy did that one time in the Batman just put people in pods and just weird stuff happened bad Ugh. weird anyway the just saying Oh, so oh, we finally get to see uh, Zuko's 
star in this and so that the Fire Nation has grown since the original series The Legend Ang. Because he says he don't want to be part of of, of, of fighting of because of all the bad rep that the Fire Nation got from the Horrier War. But he will help with the defense. But by that means just talking. Yeah. And at the end, Bolin is saying to Opal that he don't that he will not won't stop trying to get her back. And Opal asks him to help with a secret mission to get his her family out of Jiaozu. This episode was just good. Way better. Then, then the last week's one. That, that was more comedy than anything. This is a bit of comedy and a bit of seriousness. I can't wait for next week's one, but I heard that they're doing the four, like episodes 10, 11, 12, 13 on the same day. So I don't know what I'm going to do about that. But, yeah, wait and see. Also, hear that they're going to. Say who Sue and Lynn's dads are because Tossai did two guys. Don't know if they married, if she married them, one of them. Weird. And probably some other stuff that happen. I give this a 9 out of 10. It's a great episode, it's really see some real character driven stuff and emotional stuff as well for the characters. I mean, same thing. Until next time, see you later.